In this video, we'll demonstrate how to create a schedule to automatically play your music. This can be done from all three of the Casa Tunes interfaces, the web browser, the Android app, and the iOS app. From the web browser interface, click Wake and then New Event. From here, you can set which days of the week you want your event to occur. Click Next and choose the time on those days when you want the music to turn on. You can also optionally add a time when you want it to turn back off. Next, you can set a starting volume and an end volume so that the music will gradually ramp up rather than starting at a loud volume. Please note that if you set an end time for your event, the music will gradually ramp back down before it turns off. Click Next and select a source and a playlist. By default, the event will use the current source for that room and the current music in the queue, but this can be customized to play any CasaTunes playlist on any source you choose. For more information about CasaTunes playlists, please see this video. When you're finished making your selection, click Apply. The event will appear in your wake-up schedule, and you can click on it again if you ever need to edit it. You can enable or disable the event by toggling the on-off switch, or you can delete the event by clicking the red X to the left of the event name. From the Android interface, click Wake and then Add New Schedule Item. Select the time when you want the music to turn on. You can also optionally add a time when you want it to turn back off by checking the Use End Time box and then selecting a time. Next, select which days you want this to occur. In the next category, you have the option to enable volume ramping. If you check the box to ramp wake up volume, your music will start quietly and gradually get louder until it reaches the volume level you set. Please note that if you set an end time for your event, the music will gradually ramp back down before it turns off. In the next category, you can select a source and a playlist. By default, the event will use the current source for that room and the current music in the queue, but this can be customized to play any CasaTunes playlist on any source you choose. For more information about CasaTunes playlists, please see this video. In the top right corner, click Save and the event will appear in your wake schedule. The green check mark to its right indicates that it's enabled. You can disable it by clicking that box and the check mark will turn gray. You can delete events by clicking the trash can icon at the top of the page. Click the gray X to the right of the event to select it. The X will turn red for each selected event. Next, click the Remove X Schedules button. From the iOS interface, click the alarm clock icon and then Add New Event. Select the time when you want the music to turn on. You can also optionally add an end time when you want it to turn back off. Next, select which days you want this event to occur. In the next category, you can set the volume level for your music, and you have the option to enable volume ramping. If you enable it, your music will start quietly and gradually get louder until it reaches the volume level you set. Please note that if you set an end time for your event, the music will gradually ramp back down before it turns off. In the next category, you can select a source and a playlist. By default, the event will use the current source for that room and the current music in the queue, but this can be customized to play any CasaTunes playlist on any source you choose. For more information about CasaTunes playlists, please see this video. In the top right corner, click Done and the event will appear in your schedule. You can enable or disable the event by toggling the switch to the right of the event name. You can delete the event by clicking Edit in the top right corner and clicking the red minus sign to the left of the event name. A red delete prompt will appear and you can click on it to remove the event.